Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve an IO1 initialization failed blue screen error you were coming across on your Windows computer. This could definitely be a frustrating issue, and in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully go about resolving it without too much of a hassle. And we're going to go ahead and jump straight into it. So, first thing we're going to do is open up the start menu, type in CMD. Best results should come back with command prompt. You want to go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, go ahead and select yes. Now I'm going to have a command in the description of my video. I want you guys to copy it and then go up to the top bar of the command prompt window here. Right click on it, select edit, and then select paste to paste it in. Should see the operation completed successfully. Now that you've done that, you want to go ahead and type in SFC followed by a space forward slash scan now. Again, SFC space forward slash scan now. No spaces in the between scan and now. Hit enter on your keyboard. This will take a couple minutes to run, so please be patient. Okay guys, so once that's done, you just close out of here, restart your computer, and that should hopefully be about it. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. Do I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.